George. There's plenty of people that turned out to see you on the big venue of events and big, but uh, they're packed in here today. Yeah, look, unfortunately, the, uh, because of the weather, supposedly, but sunny skies, I actually said it. I said, ain't gonna rain, I can feel it. Um, but look, everyone's here, seeing everyone here, and you know, I know there's people outside, thank you so much, the ones that are outside too, and everyone over here, so look, I, I appreciate all your love, all your support, and we've got a big fight on Sunday. We are motivated, we are ready. We've got a hell of a preparation, and um, I feel all the support from the whole country behind me, so uh, here's the spot on Sunday. The city's buzzing. There's a game most of slide going on, so uh, but I'm very appreciative and, and humbled to bring this big event to Perth. Beautiful city, I've really fallen in love with, fallen in love with Perth, and um, you know, we're going to make it special. We're going to win this world title and, and create history here on Sunday. So, it's beautiful, beautiful city of Perth, and everyone that's traveled from interstate and overseas as well, thank you so much for coming to this great event and bring it on. When did you first watch this little on the action? And when did you first think that's someone I'd really like to fight? I've been watching Lomachenko when I was an amateur, when he was winning his Olympic gold medals. But that shows that someone so great winning the gold medals. And I was only this local amateur from Australia, you know, doing the hard yards, preparing myself to one day hopefully tackle the world and had that motivation, that vision. It shows you can achieve anything. Things will turn and I've become a champion, have all the belts, and he'd be chasing me. And obviously, it wasn't meant to be, but here we are, third time lucky. Sunday, can boast of a Simon Chenko, the biggest, the best, and we're ready for war. A pure war. I'm coming with everything I have, every bit I have. I have put in an unbelievable preparation. I truly back my, my training camp, and what I have done in the activity I've added to, to my training camp and my fight game. So, uh, it's going to be a hell of a fight, a war. And uh, the respect goes out the window. Like I said, I respect the man, he's a true champ, but um, you've got a true champ right here. He brings these big fights to this country, and come Sunday when that bell goes, I'm coming in this way. Thank you to everyone that's here, everyone uh, that, that's made the trip from interstate, and everyone in this beautiful city of Perth. You know, come out, watch the fight, support it, and obviously watch it on TV, on pay per view. So uh, you know, we're excited, we're ready. Bring on Sunday, see you all there. Feeling today, you having a good time? I feel great. Thank you for this moment. Thank you for this atmosphere. I'm very appreciative. Now, these people follow boxing. That's why they understand boxing. That's why they are here. And what are they going to see on Sunday? What sort of fight should we expect? It will be very interesting boxing, it will be very smart boxing, and I think this night uh, will remember all fans around the world. George says a war. Are you expecting a war? For, for him, for him, it's a war. I mean, it's a competition, it's a boxing, it's a war. And what does it mean to you to win this world title? Look, I, I have a goal. I need this title because my motivation right now is this title and be world champion again. And your final words to the people of Perth and all the people around the world who will be watching this event. What else do you have to say to them? Uh, love boxing, power boxing, and God bless you all. Yeah. 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 Yeah.